Hey guys, how's it going? We're back with another episode of Mutant Chronicles, and I found out where that one quest was for the uh, rebuilding the item shop. It's actually right over this way. In this area. That was something that really bugged me. I was like, wait, you said it was in one spot, but I gotta go here? Excuse me, miss. Could I ask you something? Huh? Me? You look a little thirsty, you see? Do you care to try a special beverage of my very own creation? There's something odd about this guy. I'd be careful, CJ. I'd be careful. How about this? Just try it once. Run one lap of the town, and I'll give you a stamp when you get back. A stamp? Just for that? That's mighty nice of you. CJ, you don't just take random drinks that people offer you. Ay ay ay. I think we have a deal. Haha, -ha. here. Drink up. Once you're done, why don't you try running over to the edge of the residential district? After that, head on over to Outlander Lane. Let's see how fast you can run. Uh, okay, sure. I'll be back! Okay, Schwarzenegger. <laughs> I'm still- Oh my god! Ah, oh, CJ! Oh, CJ, taking random drinks from strangers. Don't be worried. What's I supposed to go next? Outlander Lane? Oh, CJ. Expansion of Outlander Lane, allocated to deal with the never-ending influx of adventurers into the town. Path to carry and other stores can be found here, as well as a colorful bunch of individuals with interesting pastimes. Okay. Wow! Where did all this come from? Nice location, right? This is my apothecary. And you're my very first customer. That drink was one of my holy potions. So that's what that was all about. I did feel stronger after drinking it, alright. Sure did get some funny looks from us running, though. Of course you did. I told everyone to watch out for their favorite adventure, saved from the brink of exhaustion by yours truly. What? The brink of... Is that why some of them were crying? Poor hard-working adventure girl. If only there was a cure for exhaustion. Well, now everyone knows there is. Mine. We're lining up for miles to get their hands on the stuff. Come along now, and I'll get you a stamp. How dare you! Yeah, should be us two stamps for that. Stamp received. That guy, he is a hard worker. Builds it up so fast. Apothecary is preparing to open. Slime jelly received. 500 vodka received. Hey. 500 experience. Oh, you know what I like. 
and gained a level. Stock up on healing medicines and all manner of fortifying bombs here at the apothecary. Shopkeeper Robert. Currently unavailable, but we can uh, make it, right? crystals. They look kind of like those things that we can't break through yet. Okay. Alright, I think we're finally ready to go. Tomorrow. It's already late. I should get some rest. The quarry will still be there tomorrow. Yeah, we've got a hundred experience for that. Okay. Their quest clear. Cool. Catch that girl. <laughs> Hi there, little lady. Little lady. Been thinking about setting up a business here. Oh yeah? What kind of business? What kind? What kind? The profitable kind. I've heard real good things about you, little lady. You've got quite a reputation around here. Oh, I don't know about that. <laughs> well, I'd like you to do some market research for me. Ask around and find out what the people of this fine town need. Sure, I can do that. Okay. You okay there? You look lost in thought. Oh, hi there. Actually, I'd like to open up a pawn shop here. Hey. So I went to talk to to ask about the procedure and, well, pawnbrokers need good taste and better eyes. It's not for everyone. Opinions are like agendas. Everyone's got one, so appraisals are never alright. Airtight. A good pawnbroker knows how to think outside the box, not just about the trinkets inside it. I can't approve a prawn shop till I see you. Got what it takes to keep its lights on. Oh my. Bring me something worth exactly 100 baka and you can have your pawn shop, he said. Exactly 100 baka. It's the exactly that's the hard part. Well, that in dealing with Gox. Say, you wouldn't mind helping me out, would you? Exactly 100 baka. Goxu is definitely up to something. Sure, I'll take a look around and see what I can find. You okay, Hogan? You look stressed. Wait till I tell you, CJ. You won't believe the report I just got. Someone spotted one of the treasure chests the no good bandits took from me. If I could get that back, I'd have all I need to open up my store. Treasure? Leave it to me, Hogan. You do that for me? You'd really get me out of a bind, CJ? From what I can gather, it was seen abandoned in the woods somewhere, of course. The woods? Got it. Okay, okay. Got a lot of quests from, uh, 2nd Street. Oh! Something right here. Squash? What are you doing here? Why, this is my accessory shop. 
here I was, preparing for my grand opening, when you wouldn't be when would you believe it? I realized that I had misplaced my appraisal spectacles. These I'm currently wearing cannot be trusted to gauge the glimmerings of any given artifact. Fashion over function, you see? That sounds like a real pickle. A pickle indeed. A particularly sour one at that. Cannot possibly open up for business without low spectacles. I don't suppose I could trouble you to look around for them on my behalf. I'm quite sure they are in the town somewhere. Sure, leave it to me. I will do just that. Okay, oh wow, lots and lots and lots of quests. Oh, got another one up here. We'll go uh, check that one out in a minute. I'm just going to head down here, see if there's anyone. Nothing. how this town would look after we get, like, uh, all the shops and everything going. Look at how high she can jump, my god. Say, if you're starting up a business venture, what would it be? I'd sell pickaxes, probably. With your quarry getting so much attention, it seems like a safe bet. Pickaxes, huh? Interesting. Would you? Gladly. You can have them. Thanks! Still don't like you because you pulled the cat's tail, you little jerk. treasure hunt. If I do say so myself. I'm getting into the barrels today no matter what. Uh-oh. Admirable enthusiasm, but you might want to reel it in a bit. Oh, morning, Guru. And Goksu? Something the matter? I just came by to thank both of you for helping with that little incident at the bulwark yesterday. What's it to do with you, though? Well, if the townsfolk heard that outlanders burst open the bulwark and fled the scene, as the face of Outlander Lane, the buck would stop with me. Thankfully, it didn't come to that, thanks to you two. Must be tough, being responsible for all us outlanders. You can say that again. So tough, in fact, that I could really use a little help with something. Oh no. Oh yeah? Help with what? If you run into Melora again, bring her back to here to me. I told her to apologize for what she did, but she ran off into the quarry and hasn't been back since. Melora, the girl who attacked us with magic, you want us to bring her here? I certainly do. 
You'll be well compensated, of course. Might even be a stamp in it for you. Better be more than a stamp. Little bird told me you're something of a collector. Well, deal. I'll keep an eye out while I'm treasure hunting. That sounds like a deal to me. I had a feeling you'd say that. So, dinner's on you next time, yeah? Small price to pay. I'll be on Outlander Lane. Come find me when that girl sees sense. Hey, baby. Okay, okay. Interesting. that one, uh, you know, that showed us that there's going to be a trade post somewhere so it would pop up again, but haven't seen it. Really disappointed. Were these the spectacles you were looking for? Simply impossible to discern dispersion in tiny gemstones without spectacles such as these. With this, the preparations for my grand opening are complete. Allow me to stamp your card for you. Hey, hey. Stamp received. Man, this guy, he is hard. Accessory shop is prepared to open. 500 baka received. Yeah. 500 XP. Even better. set this up to test you. You've been looking for something you can value at a hundred baka. Well, I don't think Gokusu ever said anything about that. Oh? I mean, 
mean, he said it himself, right? Appraisals will vary from person to person. No such thing as an exact one is there. A good pawnbroker knows how to think outside the box. I think this is what he is getting at. You're right. Genius. I'll take this to him right away. Oh, before I forget, here, take a stand. Stamp. Look at that guy, man. Gotta find him whenever I need buildings. The pawn shop is preparing to open. Hey, got some more baka. Mmm, got the experience. I love that. Level up? There we go. Level 11. Nice, nice. starting up a business venture, what would it be? I've heard there's a lot of money in setting traps. Doesn't sound like tough work, either. Traps. Consistency. I asked around for you, but the thing is, from what I could tell, no one can seem to agree on the best way to make money would be. Sorry, couldn't be a more help. Help? Help? You've helped more than you know. I have. Pickaxe for mining, traps for setting, rod for fishing. I think I can work with that information. I'll open a tool shop. I'll be rich! Ha <laughs> ha! Thank you kindly, little lady. Here, have a stamp. Got a stamp? Axes, pickaxes, fishing rods, and traps all in one place. Shopkeeper, Felipe. We need ore to make uh, the level two. But we can make our uh, hunt. It's a thousand baka. Oh, we need it. Ore, stone, not a 
available for purchase. This item you can fish at fishing spots inside the dungeons. As you level up your fishing rod, more fish will become available to catch. Okay, okay. We got a lot more shops opened up now, like oh my gosh. CJ I've been hearing about, huh? Runbeard. I'm in charge of defense around here. In charge? Like of commander or something? I didn't know they had titles like that here. Titles? Ah, who cares about nonsense like that? Huh? It's a matter of heart, child. I have taken it upon myself to defend this town because my heart tells me I must. So, you just put yourself in charge then? You'll find no one better for the job. I promise you that. Regardless, I have orders for you. Really? Orders? Orders? For me? We are rapidly running out of weapons. Someone must remedy that immediately. You know, if you're offering a stamp, there's no need for the Admiral Act. Stamps? Again? These stamps have gone to your brains, all of you. Fine, if that's what it takes, now get to work. Yes, sir. Now we know, uh, the way to CJ's heart. Get in some stamps. That guy's still not there, okay. So let me see. Can fish now. Hmm. Let's go fishing spot first. Get see how fishing is in this game.
wants to fight us again? I'm gonna have to clean up tree. still can't jump over that one thing. Head back to Hogan, uh, turn in this stuff, uh, make some of the new food if we can, uh, accessories, everything with the fish and all that.
should I sell those here? CJ, now I can finally get those shop doors open. I think you might just be interested in one or two things I've got, so swing by when you can. Sure. Stamp received. Man, that guy, hardest working person here. Leveled up our town a little more. Alright, we got the trading post now. Cool, cool. 500 baka. 500 XP gained us a level. I love that. Trading wares for whatever Hogan has in stock at his trading post. You can also exchange stamps for rewards. Okay. We can trade lumber, uh get stone, lumber to get ore, ore plus five. So we need more uh, stamps. Oh, so that's a one-time thing. Alright, two more stamps and then we'll be able to get this. Cool. Oh, we'll be able to finally get some of that meat. Interesting. Okay, okay. within the hunting grounds inside the dungeons you can obtain resources and cuisine. Okay. I like it. to the oh we don't have a lot of money we might not be able to oh 
we need one. And we were able to upgrade her weapon. Saber caps. Okay. Okay. Got some more things added to the menu, though. That's good. Let's just fast travel our way there. CJ, I heard from Gaktu that you're looking for that Metal Gore, right? Well, I agreed to keep an eye out while I'm treasure hunting, sure. You'll be treasure hunting somewhere pretty dangerous, then. She's on the other side of a blockade a fair bit down. There's a bit of a trick to opening it up, though. There should be a lever around the blockade somewhere. Make sure to give it a good push. Good push, huh? Alright. Got it. See you when I get back, then. Let's do this. Uh, no. Girl's great sword is great enough to send projectiles back where they came? Oh. further in a minute. I want to go back uh, up there. Also, I want to get those barrels because uh, we need uh, vodka. I was thinking I was far enough away where you wouldn't be able to get me. Ah, oh, seriously? Stay in green stones. Trap. 
trap is set. She's got to be a little further in here. Here we are. There she is! That's her! Shut face. I want 
terrorize this town no longer. My aim is straight and true. Magical lyrical missile. Can you stop shoving at us again? What's this girl's problem? Thank you. Stay back, scoundrels! You've come face to face with New Nebia's very own guardian peacekeeper. Guided by the room's holy height, light, it is I, once again, Melor, ardent defender of love and justice. Okay, Satan. I don't know who you think you're talking to, but we're just a couple of adventurers. You won't lie away out of this, that vicious visage, the smell of bloodlust. Bandits, both of you. I know a bandit when I see one, or smell one. I'm gonna let her talk to you like that. <laughs> Guru, nice. She's clearly talking about you. Melor, please hear us out. I'm a scavenger. Wouldn't dream of thieving from anyone who's alive and kicking. Prove it. Excuse me? If you really are an ordinary if you really are ordinary adventurers, then prove it. What kind of proof would you like exactly? Show the adventurer license we got. Wait, I know. This. Here. Stamp card. The stamp card? <sighs> You're gonna get us killed. Here, an explorer's license. Signed and sealed by the Acton Mayor. Thank you, Garo. Oh my, this stamp card is a genuine article. You are adventurers, after all. Oh my, I'm so very sorry. <laughs> yep, Garu, that's what I was thinking. Wrong. I was sure those lens bandits would show up today. Lens bandits? Yes, you've seen them, right? On the outskirts of town. Lots of lenses in the barrels. The bandits are obsessed with them. Plenty of ore and artifacts down there, but they only have eyes for the lenses. What made you so sure they'd be coming here today? A few days back, a huge raw lens was discovered alongside an equally huge load golem. Really? This had better not be a joke, little girl. Don't joke about something like that. That's why I thought they'd be here. We have to go get it. Right now. <laughs> Thank you, Karu. Wait. We were told to take this kid back to the town. For all we know, she might have smashed that lens up when she attacked us yesterday. Ah, right. Melor, we're not here for lenses. We're here to bring you back to town. Gakshu's orders. That's right, everyone's worried about you, so come along, okay? No? He's mad at me for breaking the bulwark, isn't he? Oh, now she cares about the bulwark. No one's mad, the hole is already fixed up, so everything's fine. Come on. No. Just whack her over the head with the sword and take her back. A real magical girl wouldn't run away after making a mess. A real magical girl would make it right. It's already been made right, you magical girl. Nah, that's not right. You don't sound like no magical girl I know. And 
Not at all. Not at all? Have I gone mad? No. Reverse psychology. Keep going, Garu. Shut it. Look, even a magical girl is gonna make mistakes. But mistakes aren't all bad, so long as you learn from them. If you mess up, take a step back, cool off, and think about what you could have done better. Talk it over with mates, or your folks. That's how you grow, ain't it? That's the right way to be a magical girl. Am I wrong? No. I was wrong. Well then, how about we get you home? Okay. How did you do that? Got some meat. Good, good. Uh, Actually, let's just walk out and then we'll talk to that guy out there and give him the uh, ore. I think I got everything he asked for. Impressive. You did better than I expected. Could be the makings of a soldier in you yet. Make with the stamp and I'll be soldiering on out of here, okay? Oh, that's right, you wanted a stamp. Well, here you are. I'll be calling on you again, private. Oh, a thousand experience. I like that. Nice. Still down. Nothing there. to make this. about what I did wrong. Listen to this. What's got you so modest all of a sudden? You sure you got the right girl? Mm, I'm wondering myself. Pretty sure. Well, I'm not complaining. You're gonna stay out of trouble from now on, right? Right. I think our friends here deserve an extra apology. They helped clean up your mess at the bulwark yesterday. You did? No trouble at all. We'd best be getting back, though. That's right. Lots to do. Well, we 
won't hold you up a moment longer. Besides, we've got to apologize to the act acting mayor, too. Isn't that right, Melor? Right. Just <laughs> wondering if she was gonna join us or not. And we're off. Alright, let's get back in there and find that load golem. Oh, that's right. Hey, we got 20 stamps now. Almost got, like, uh, this stamp sheet all filled in. Stamp received. 300 XP? Quest clear. Wait, 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 wait! Main quest 8, defeat the load. for uh, this. Need more mushrooms and stones. Still got 140 stamps that we gotta get. Yeah. But we got a green uh, thingy, Mababber, right? It wasn't there. Is it here?
Let's just go and beat the uh, lost uh, goblin. Oh, that's a different kitty cat. Look outside the window and I see a cat just sitting on my uh, vehicle. charm, as I say. We're coming for you, Lord Golem. Your raw lens is as good as mine. Love the confidence. Big fan. But have you ever actually fought a Lord Golem before? Nope, she says. And this raw lens, it's basically a bunch of magical power smushed together. Yes? Beans with lenses are generally a lot tougher than beans without them. Yes. Seems likely. That's what my dad always said. Probably gonna be quite tasty in a fight. Your dad didn't say anything about how to take it down by any time. Exactly did he get his hands on a raw lens anyway? What did he do? His best! So that's what I'm gonna do. I knew I should have come alone. Even the best cabinets have to start somewhere. I might not know exactly what to do yet, but I do know we'll have to hit it hard. Guess that's the best plan we've got. Don't expect me to stick around if things get hairy, though. I don't fancy dying in a place like this.
for the best. I don't want to level up for it.
should have just pressed R2 and I would have been saved. That one was uh, blocked by another one of those door that we couldn't get past. Crystal. He's eventually gonna be able to break him with the sword, right? Oh, this got to be the golem.
Ta-da! It's, it's bloody huge. Well, it's big, sure, but, um, yeah. Not as big as one my dad found. Rats! Still not good enough. <laughs> what are you playing at? Could have cracked it. Nah, raw lenses don't crack so easy. Take special technology to turn it into a room lens of any use, though. Only a guardian can do it, right? Guardians, ancient protectors of the ruins, guardians. As if I'd know. Never met one. Your family are all scavengers, ain't they? Your pop? Your pop's pop? None of them ever mention guardians? Well, I did ask my grandpa once, the first time I ever heard of the guardians. And what'd they say? Said they didn't know anything, and that I shouldn't bring it up again. You didn't believe him, did you? I did. They didn't know nothing about it. Why would they tell you to keep your mouth shut? Rule number one of being an adult. Always ask questions. <laughs> Are you calling them liars? My family? I'll have you know. Okay, okay, I'm not calling anyone a liar. Forget it. You're honest, alright? Honestly naive. What was that? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> anyway, even if you could turn it into a rune less, you probably couldn't use it. The lens has to choose you. And no lens would ever choose someone as grumpy as you. The lens gets to choose? What's that about? What do you mean? Don't you know anything about lenses? Don't you know anything? Do you? <laughs> I know people can't be trusted. The only thing I trust in this world are the sword in my hand and the coin in my purse. What a boring life that must be. Don't make me laugh, kid. Is excitement gonna fill your belly at the end of the day? Rune lenses choose their owner. Believe me or don't. No. Either way, unless you're chosen, you'd never be able to use it. It's like they're alive. Gross. Some say they are, yeah. No one knows for sure, though. Besides, if you can't use it, no reason, reason to hang on to it, is there? Might as well sell it. You could get a small fortune depending on the grade. From its size, I reckon this one could fetch a pretty penny. Seems like it could be made magical too. If someone knew how. Could be looking at about 200,000 baka. Oh my. That would be nice. 200,000 baka? <laughs> That's not bad. Oi! What? This thing is rare. And potentially powerful. And it's worth a lot of money, I get that, but... If someone cared more about them than they did about money, why would that be? What's brought this on? Listen. What would someone with all the money in the world want with the, these things? Beats me? More money? That simple, is it? Or... Or... Maybe they like shiny things. Oh, CJ. Like a bird or something? More 
fool me for asking a child, I suppose. How would I know what rich folk think? Ask them yourself. You probably just want magic power to know. Magic power, huh? Well, the real work starts now. The barrels await. Let's go. This thing is too small for my pouch. We'd best pile some more in. Enough to drink the tavern dry sounds about right. <laughs> Thousand XP obtained. Quest clear. Ah, oh, is it gonna warp us out? Okay, into the ruins. Ah, I got a defense ring. Oh, nice for CJ. Hoppity. Another door? So these are the barrels. They're even cooler than I thought. I didn't expect it to go so deep. Wild to think this exists under that crummy little town. I smell trouble. Keep your eyes peeled. I know this is never wrong. Something bad's up ahead. The evil sorcerer's curse? by the gods and sealed in the ruins. I bet it's him. I'll take that bet. Shocked face? Company, eh? You got a problem, mate? You guys smell worse than me. Guru? These are bandits. They're the ones who attacked Hogan! Bandits? The lens-obsessed weirdos the other girl weirdo who <laughs> told us about? Thanks for taking care of that load, Golden Lady. Now hand over the lens and we won't have any trouble. Trouble? Ha! <laughs> for you, maybe. Did you forget what happened last time we met? Well, let's see what happens this time, eh? Lads, all in. Wanna go all in again? Ugh. What's a bumpkin like you doing down with a beast anyway? Fall back, lads. We'll just come back and take the lens from their dead bodies. Assuming we die. Hold it! You stole those lenses, didn't you? Drop him! Eat this. Uh oh. CJ, get down! Uh oh. What? What was that? My ears are still ringing. Runic round. I've seen him once before. Sorcerers who could make him are few and far between, though. Runic rounds? How did bandits get their dirty hands on something like that? Good question. Moreover, how did they even get in? I very much doubt they've got the necessary paperwork. Must have bribed the lookout or something. 
plenty of adventurers around though that get spotted in no time. Nah, I don't like this. Too suspicious. Let's head back for now and talk to that Acton Mayor about it. It's just a couple of bandits. You worry too much. I'm not worried about myself. We have to tell the other adventurers and escorts to be on their toes. Easier said than done. Time to put that sword to use. Go, Garu! Go, go, Garu! Give it a risk, will ya? That's far too many rocks. Go, Garu! Go, go, Garu! I told you there's too many. I break my arm trying to get through that. Are you joking? So... What? We just buried alive down here? Calm down. There's got to be another way out somewhere. Where? Where? The Menir. We have to find the Menir. Menir? That ancient stone plate thing? Exactly. There was an old one in the great forest, all busted up. That rock I saw when we first met in the woods. But why would there be one of them here? Why is it important right now? Focus on the where. Just trust me. Mysterious rooms known locally as the Moon Barrels. It's just every other room barrels brought countless adventures to the area in search of fame and fortune. Lightning monsters lie in wait with it. Oh? 100 XP? Another quest clear? Mystery of the Menir. What you up to, butthead cat? We still got a ways to go with our path. Isn't that a Menir? Definitely the same pattern as the one in the forest. This one looks to be in better condition, though. There's an indent here. Seems like something could slot in. You don't think a room lens could power it? My grandpa told me about something like that before. Even a low-grade loom ran, room lens ought to do the trick, I think. What you doing, Loki? Not that it matters much if we don't have one. Whoa. What are you doing with a room lens? Oh my god, CJ. Just... Loki, down. Down. It's alive! Right then. Let's get out of here. Let's activate that sign first. Are we waiting for something? That lion sack of... Why is it working? 
I ain't about to die down here. Useless hunk of rock. Do something. Uh, wait. Calm down. Let me have a look. There must be something more missing. There's some kind of inscription here. Looks like the Meneer key my granddad told me about. Let's see. Mysterious, machinery powered by more witnesses. The key to awaken their power lies in the puzzle found upon them. Rotate the blocks to connect pathways and reveal the true power line dormant with it. signpost down there that we didn't activate. Ah. Yeah! We're out. We're really out. I think I'm gonna bomb. So this manure is like a portal to the one in the barrels. Okay. I bet that's how those bandits got in. Makes sense. They've been taking a lot of lens. Why do you know about the Meneer, though, Guru? I've seen him around. Mercs see all sorts on the road. But what about that rune lens we used to activate it? Where'd you get that? Hmm? Oh my god, CJ. I found it. Stuck in that busted up veneer we saw in the woods. Heard a rumor about it in town. Headed out to investigate. Found the lens stuck in it. From what I can gather, should be quite a few of them around. Okay. Is that so? Excuse me, friend. But where are we? This is a farm just outside New Nebia. So sorry to drop in on you like that. You okay? My name's CJ, and this big lug is Garu. We're adventurers. We're just down the barrels. I'm Ayas, owner of this here farm. Not that I can do much farming since the earthquake. Unless my eyes are playing tricks on me. Seems like you pair came tumbling out of that rock just now. That's right. Seems like this rock is connected to the barrows. Well, I'll be. You haven't seen any dodgy folk around here lately, have you? Bandits and such? Can't say I have. Dogs haven't been barking lately, neither. So they haven't seen nothing. Except for you two. Just now, that is. Huh. I suppose the bandits must be using another veneer, then. I had no idea this rock was so special. Always thought it was just some old monument to the before people. I knew it. I'm never gonna be able to reopen this farm. Were you planning a grand reopening? I was thinking about it. Request from Miss Mayor herself. Said there ain't enough food to keep all you venturers satisfied. Unfortunately, I don't have none of what I need to rebuild the farm. No seeds for crops, neither. Ayas, today might just be your lucky day. We're happy to help. Oh, we are, are we? Some barn materials and crop seeds ought to be enough to get started. Should be easy to find in that forest over yonder. Yes, sir. Do you forget about them bandits that are after your lens? 
are you just too much of a softy for your own good? Go see the Acta Mayor, tell her about the bandits, then get back to treasure hunting. That was the plan, wasn't it? Can't do much on an empty belly, can you? If there's no food, there'll be no treasure hunting for anyone. She got you there, Guru. Besides, those bandits think we're dead. They're probably back there rummaging through the wreckage for that low golem's lens. It's gonna take him a while to dig through all that. I reckon we've got time for another brief detour. Plus, a food shortage would most likely affect the tavern too, you know? Fine. Let's just get this over with. <laughs> Guru. Mysterious stone pillars that can be found around the town. Once activated by the insertion... No, I'm watching you, cat. Once activated by the insertion of a rune lens, the pillars take anything that touches them to a different location. Clearly, they have some connection to the rune barrels. Clear. 100 XP? I like that. Ooh, level 4. Okay. And a level 3. I like that. Just one meat. This takes us to the farm. They're gonna have like a teleporter something for us. A signpost. Plaza. see if there's like a signpost or something for like fast travel. Oh, nothing there. Okay. There's got to be something that we can do at the pasturage eventually. Ah, so that opened up there. Okay, okay. done that. Nice, we've already uh, secured two of them. Something the matter? You look like you've seen a ghost. CJ, you won't believe what happened, pet. I wanted to go get some goods for the new menu, you see. Plenty of ingredients in the woods, I thought to myself. So I went, recipe in hand. The woods? Haven't you heard? The woods are crawling with monsters lately. I know, I know. But it's not like I planned a picnic, is it? In and out, I thought. I barely taken three steps when... There it was. What? A monster? What else? Attacked me from behind and took my recipe. What kind of monster? Couldn't tell you, pet. I heard it flip-flapping behind me and ran like the wind. Flip-flapping. Okay. Leave it to me. I'll head back to the woods and check it out. Could I ask you to do that? That recipe is dear to me, though. It's from him! After all, it's too important to let some monster get their mitts on it. You're not asking, I'm offering. Him, huh? Can't 
have that, then I'll go get it back right away. Okay, okay. Hey, CJ, can I borrow you for a tick? Sure, something up? Just wondering if you'd be up for a little feud work on Outlander Lane. Find out what's eating everyone, you know? Got folks from all across Alaran gathered here on top of. Hmm. Okay, so a melting pot, so a lot of people. Alright, alright. As it stands, they see sense in solidarity against the objectors, but we can't rely on that to keep them getting along. So I'd appreciate it if you'd lend them an ear to vent their frustrations. Blow off some steam. No problem. Leave it to me. I can't upgrade that. Bad points. About Outlander Lane? Well, it's pretty dusty, I guess. Oh, right. That must be because of all the construction. This just won't do. Um, something the matter? Oh, CJ, you could say that, yes. Ranbir placed an order, you see. I have exhausted all avenues at my disposal to fulfill it. I have nothing to show for all my efforts. I'd hate to disappoint him. After all my boasting, how could I have been so foolish? I couldn't possibly face Ranbir having failed him so. CJ, you are quite cordial with Ranbir, are you not? Cordial? <laughs> Not quite the word I'd use, but sure. I'm sure he would prefer to hear this dreadful news from a friendly face. Ah, I see. Yeah, okay. I'll let him know. Alright, nothing we can really do with those. happy here. There's barely anything to do. I guess that's true. Bad points? Ha! Where are the good points? There's nowhere to hang out here. If you're not drinking or shopping, there's not much else going on, is there? When you put it like that... I think that's all I'm likely to get for now. So that way is probably gonna open up eventually. It's pretty much sums it up, I think. Everyone I asked had quite a lot to complain about. Well, ask you to let them vent, and vent they did. Thank you, CJ. So, how are you gonna deal with all that, then? Ha ha ha! I just did. I'd say they feel a lot better already with that all off their chest, wouldn't you? That's all people need sometimes, you know? Someone to listen. And that someone was me, huh? I owe you one, CJ. You owe me two. A thousand, ooh, a thousand baka. Nice. 500 XP? But no stand. Wow, wow. Okay. 
nice, nice. Another thing added to our accessory list. Nothing there. Good morning. Good timing, little lady. Oh, yeah? Why is that? I heard you've been making yourself very useful around here. Mighty popular with the townsfolk. Oh, I don't know about that. <laughs> I reckon a giant brooch would be just the thing to make this a real hit. Could you do the honor, CJ? You know I have to fight the giant tree fiend to get that, right? I do. But I also know you do just about anything for a stamp. Guilty? Alright, here. This should be enough for you to make those improvements, right? Oh ho, okay, okay, here. Try cutting the giant branch with this axe. What? I mean, sure. Reduce giant branch to ribbons? Hehe. <laughs> the advertising practically writes itself. Ah, I see. There. That it? Extraordinary acts endorsed by everyone's favorite adventurer. I'll be rich. <laughs> and I thought you were just being generous. Stamp received. Oh, we leveled up that. Nice, nice. experience a bit of everything. Oh, we gained a level. Cool, cool. Uh, we need stone. Lightweight lumber. Heavy stone, lightweight lumber. So we can get the stone for the axe. The axe is probably what we need to upgrade these. I'm willing to bet. Yo, CJ. What's up, Hogan? You ain't seen Sarita around, have you? Got a delivery for her, but she ain't nowhere to be found. Can't say I have, I'm afraid. You want me to go look? Would you mind? Thank you kindly. looking for you. He says he has a package you ordered or something. Oh, my. Okay. Please tell him I'll be over in a jiffy. Got him. said she'd be over to pick it up soon. But what's so special about this thing anyway? Probably shouldn't say, but since it's you, CJ, it's some kind of new seasoning. Looks pretty strong to me. More new dishes? Sorry to must be feeling inspired. Can't wait to try for myself. Oh, got a stamp. Did we level up this, or was it... Okay, cool, cool. A 
thousand Barker. I like it. Oh, seven fifty XP. Lightweight lumber, so we can always swap it out for that. Huge ore. Okay, okay. Alright, alright. Got some decent stuff there. Things that we need to make some improvements on some other spots. Cool, cool. to this town today. We had a lot more shops and everything opened up in upgrades. I haven't seen the mayor in a long time, though. Alright, residential district. Up to big guy. Oh dear. Oh my. You okay there, man? Ma'am, I'm not old enough to be a ma'am, am I? Oh my kitty. Of course, you're Myra. Maybe that's why I just can't decide what to cook tonight. I'd hope to get some meat, but with the forest how it is at the moment. You want me to go get some for you? Wait, you're... You must be CJ. I've heard all about how helpful you are. If you wouldn't mind. Beast meat, right? No problem. Back! Got that meat you wanted, too. My hero. Thank you so much. I have a feeling I'll be calling on you again. So do I. Got another stamp. 750 experience. No money though. No baka. We actually gotta go on there to do it. That's fine. I'm here. I have a question for you from Bertrand. He's very sorry, but he can't fulfill your order. I should have known it would be impossible to get 100 superb swords so easily. Suppose we have to make do with what weapons we have on hand. Did he say a hundred? Is that odd? Or haven't you noticed the monsters increasing in number by the hour? We must ensure each and every resident is armed against this threat. Perhaps if we had 100 pieces of the finest iron ore. Oh, jeez. Okay, so, bye then. <laughs> oh my. Okay, okay. Ranbir, your message. Typical Ranbir, eh? 100 superb swords. <laughs> no, it is my shame to say that I could not acquire them. Perhaps one was somehow able to acquire the materials for their production. CJ, would you mind? Okay, so bye then! <laughs> Okay. I like that.
Okay. He needs Yeti Whisker. But we can at least get hers. Oh, upward attacks. Nice, nice. Upward and downward attacks. Cool. I think we will stop right there for today. Got a lot done. Got a lot of more uh, shops added into the town. Got a lot more stamps. We are able to knock out, like, oh my god, a lot of quests today. It felt really good. Just got, like, a couple of these ones right here, and yeah, we'll be on to the next one. Not bad, not bad. Really like chopping through this game. I'm really digging it. Huh. Just got these two. But hey, guys, I'd like to thank you very much for watching, and I hope to catch you on our next one. Take care.